Preparation of pigments from the extract of spinach leaves by paper chromatography. Paper chromatography is an analytical method used to separate colored substances, especially pigments. In paper chromatography, the sample is distributed between a stationary phase and a mobile phase. The stationary phase is usually a piece of high quality filter paper. The mobile phase is a developing solution that travels up the stationary phase carrying the samples with it. When the mobile phase is moved over the sample on the stationary phase, the components of the sample get gradually separated from one another. Our aim here is to separate the pigments from an extract of spinach leaves by paper chromatography. Materials required Chromatographic chamber with lid Extract of spinach leaves Isopropyl alcohol water mixture Wattman filter paper strip Fine capillary tube Thread Scale And a pencil Procedure Take a Wattman filter paper strip and draw a line with a pencil above 2 cm from one end. Draw another line lengthwise from the center of the paper. Name the point at which the two lines intersect as P. Take the extract of spinach leaves using a capillary tube. Put a drop of the leaf extract at point P. Allow it to dry in open air. Put another drop on the same spot and dry again so that the spot is rich with the mixture. Take a piece of thread and tie the filter paper with it. Suspend the filter paper vertically in the chromatographic chamber containing solvent which is a mixture of isopropyl alcohol and distilled water. Make sure that the pencil line remains about 1 cm above the solvent level. Keep the chamber undisturbed for some time. Notice the rising solvent along with the leaf extract. As the solvent has risen, you will notice different spots of the pigments such as carotene, xanthophyll, chlorophyll A and chlorophyll B of spinach leaf extract on the filter paper. Take the filter paper out of the chamber and mark the distance that the solvent has risen on the paper. This is called the solvent front. Dry the filter paper and measure the distance of the solvent front from the original line and the distance of each spot from the original line. The RF values of the pigments can be calculated using the formula RF is equal to distance travelled by the component from the original line divided by distance travelled by the solvent from the original line. Precautions Always make use of a fine capillary tube. Keep the chamber undisturbed and covered during the experiment. The spot should be rich with the sample.